Well, you see, that one stood up quite a bit. I'm gonna have to go in over the top. Mm. <laughs> Almost. You guys ready for this one? We got a great deal for you today. King and the Aki Spinner Darts Review begins right now. Okay guys, it is darts review time. I got a great video for you today. And hey, I gotta say, perfect timing as well. Now, I did not plan this whatsoever, but I actually purchased these, must have been two months ago, probably longer actually. Gives you an idea of how far behind I am on my reviews. But yeah, purchased these about two months ago over at Dart Shopper in the Netherlands. Now, here's the good news for you guys watching the video this week, the week of November, Black Friday. These are currently part of Dart Shopper's Black Friday sale. So I'm gonna put a screenshot up here. The normal price of these, already an amazing deal at 25 US dollars. This week only for their Black Friday sale, 20 US dollars. I think that's a great deal for a classic 90% tungsten barrel, all sorts of extra goodies as you're about to see. And if you look down below, 21 and 23 grams that these come in. And of course, I had to buy the lightest version available, the 21 grams. I'm gonna have a link down below. It's gonna take you over to Dart Shopper. Have a look at these King of the Aki darts, the spinners, which ironically don't come with spinning stems. You would think a name spinner would come with spinning stems. Yeah, they don't. Normal stems, but yeah, I'll have a link down below in the pinned comments. It's gonna take you over to Dart Shopper. Have a look around, check out their sales, and I uh, would highly recommend King of the Aki darts. I think I've reviewed just about every set they have. This was one of the last sets that I've never reviewed. So finally getting around to doing it today. And um, what a classic barrel though. I gotta say, if you look back in the day, like Eric Bristow, Adrian Lewis, Glenn Durant, who else we got? Chizzy back in the day, all used a dart very similar to this. Rob Cross, did I mention him as well? Classic straight barrel, multi-ring grip. It's gonna work well for a lot of people and it has for years and years. You can't really do much, too much better than this in my opinion. But hey, let's get into the video. We got a great set of darts to show you. 20 bucks, I mean, come on. Here we go, King of the Octa Spinner. Okay, guys, well, let me show you what you get for your Black Friday 20 US dollars. So everything comes in this compact cardboard box. King of the Aki Spinner, 90% tungsten, 21 grams. So there's the box. Inside, we have this King of the Aki wallet and little treat in here. They give you not one, but two sets of standard size King of the Aki flights with apparently my fingerprints all over them. But yeah, two sets of flights. And as you see here, you got an intermediate set of stems. And this was a set of medium king grip stems, but as you see there, one of them was broke. So, uh, hey, dart shopper, you owe me a set of stems. But yeah, those are actually the stems that were installed in the darts. And yeah, just one of them came broke. Not a huge deal. I'm not going to lose any sleep over it. But yeah, dart shopper, you owe me a set of stems. But there's the barrels, huh? Classic design. That's about as good as it gets right there. Straight barrel, multi-ring, a highly effective dart for many, many players. Silver points up front. There's the intermediate king grip stem. Super nice stems, by the way. And look at that. No corners cut here. They do include the stem clip. And on the back end there, there are the King of the Aki standard size flights. Love, love the logo design there for King of the Aki. But um, there's the darts. Let's go into the next clip and I'll hit you with all the stats and dimensions you need to know. Did I show you that logo there? Look at that. That's awesome, right? Yeah, let's roll into the stats and dimensions. Alrighty guys, it's that time again for some rotating stats and dimensions. And check this out. We've got straight barrel, multi-ring, they're affordable, and they're 90% tungsten. I mean, come on, what more could you possibly want here? Well, except maybe for some specialty points, right? As these only come with a set of generic silver points, kind of on the short side as well. They only stick out of the barrel, 26 millimeters in total. But yeah, the barrels, like I just said, 90% tungsten, heck of a deal for 20 bucks, right? The barrel length coming in at 51 millimeters even. In the barrel width, pay attention guys, this is where there's a mistake on the Dart Shopper website. The 21 gram version, they list these as six millimeters wide. That is not correct. These are actually 6.35 millimeters wide. So that's why we do the reviews. We like to get you guys the correct information. So I unscrewed the stem, checked out the drill depth. They're drilled out 11.8 millimeters deep in the back end. And as far as the match weight goes, again, these are advertised as 21 grams. The lightest barrel, 21.04. 
21.07 and finally 21.10 so what's that only six one hundredths of a gram off from lightest to heaviest pretty good job there but let's roll into the next clip and i'll tell you all about this multi-ring grip all righty guys let me hit you with a quick grip level here and believe it or not we're dealing with a somewhat grippy barrel that's for sure these multi-rings are spaced just far enough apart where you really feel each individual edge of the multi-ring they're not like super sharp like a shark grip or razor grip but man they got some bite to them i'm gonna say grip level 3.3 .3 on a scale of one to five so um yeah pretty grippy front gripper middle gripper even a rear gripper as long as you don't go near the smooth section back there it's gonna work well for a lot of people right and um, up front not a fan of these points we got a bit of a lip there i'm gonna have to scuff the points up before we get them on the board and throw them because these silver points will not hold well into my firm dartboard so um we're gonna throw them just like you see them though this exact setup this uh, intermediate stem standard size flights and they should work really really well so let's get them on the board and see how they fly okay guys let's see how this goes i just had a fantastic warm-up the darts are flying incredibly well i was just scoring i was just scoring really really well so yeah let's hope that continues and then, funny enough i was trying to experiment with different grips front grip middle grip rear grip I could not throw these things poorly. It just, everything worked. So yeah, just a very versatile barrel. Doesn't matter where you grip, they're just gonna work well. So let's hope that continues now that the camera is on. Five random throws, we'll keep it simple. And I'm gonna start with middle grip. I'll switch to a front grip though for the last couple turns. Middle grip, grippy, light touch on the barrel. Yeah, look at that. Standing up for me, pretty nice. 100 out of the gate. Yeah, and it's funny, when I have a middle grip, the darts stand up a bit. My darts typically go on the board flat, so when I switch to a front grip, you watch. They, they'll lay down for me a little bit. But again, I'm going to stick with a middle grip. Feels comfortable, kind of right on the balance point. That one stood up. Should be able to get over the top. Yes. Our dart saver. Let me move these two out of the way. There it is. Right on that top wire, the trouble 20, right in the middle of the bed. And now, hey, let's switch to a front grip. Might as well, right? And I noticed the dart got to the board a little quicker, so. Strange, if you, you adjust your grip ever so slightly, how differently the dart performs. Ooh, get out of there. Of course I had to hit a trouble five somewhere in this video. Oh, oh yeah, run it back. That's more editing, third heart saver. There it is. And I think with a front grip, I don't have to throw the dart as hard because that first dart just rocketed right in the trouble five. Again, front grip, and I'll throw a little more gently. All right. That one kind of lofted in the board. Oh, that third dart is deadly tonight. Run it back. Now, hey, let's go to rear grip. I'm gonna be right in front of that smooth section on the very back end. Kind of the, the dart's almost resting on my thumb. Oh yeah, so that stands up a lot more. Look at that, I just banked it off that first dart. That was perfect, perfect marker dart when the dart stands up. I'll throw the bull on the last one, I'm kind of blocked. Oh, 20, 25, hey, 105. Nice, see, yeah, all grips work. We'll do one more. I'm just having fun throwing these things. Oh, you know what? I haven't mentioned it anywhere in this video. You guys know the main theme of this channel. There it is. Great darts don't have to cost a lot of money. I love bringing you guys the deals. These darts 100% fit in that category. Even at the regular price, $25, you're still getting a banging deal for 20 bucks. I mean, come on, right? Last throw, two at the 20, one at the bull. And we'll go middle grip it just feels comfortable in the middle kind of on the balance point 
rest on my thumb. Come up a little bit. And that's in. Pull. Ah, six. Mulligan. <laughs> you guys do that. 100. So yeah, as you see there, and I, I normally don't throw the darts like that. I just use one grip for the entire throwing demo, but I was all over the place there. Still scoring fairly consistent, right? So again, that just goes to show how easy of a dart this is to throw. Once you get used to that grippiness, man, you're good to go. So um, let's roll into the next clip. Nice little 180 for you with all sorts of deflections. Somehow that third dart got in there. And we'll do a wrap up monster score incoming at the end. Here we go. Good deflection, right? <laughs> Two good deflections. We'll take that one. Boom! <laughs> How did that third dart get in there? I honestly do not know. I'm going to pull this second one to show you a little better. So that was the second dart right there closest to the camera. There's a third. Seriously? How did those get in there? Stacked right on top of one another. One of my more unusual 180s to end a video, that's for sure. But hey, hope you guys enjoyed the close-up look and review of the King of the Aki spinners that don't spin, right? So again, reminder, Dart Shopper Black Friday sale link down below in the pinned comments going to take you over there. Highly, highly recommend you check them out and take a look, uh, take a look around to the rest of the store. Maybe they're having some other sales as well. But King of the Aki stuff. Highly recommend. So yeah, thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment, or I actually prefer if you love to comment. Let me know what you thought of the video. Let me know what you thought of these darts, or hey, any of the other King of the Aki stuff as well. Now, as far as a recommendation, come on, you guys know they're gonna get a monster score. 90% tungsten barrel for 20 bucks. You really can't go wrong there. In my opinion, the only thing holding these things back are the points. You slap on a set of specialty points here, you have a near perfect set of darts that's gonna work extremely well for the vast majority of players. Straight barrel multi-rang, and I know I've said that a million times in this video, but it's about as good as it gets. And I know it's not fancy, but again, it's just going to work well for so many players. I'm going to go 9-7 out of 10. So that's a great score. And you know what? Even if these things weren't on sale, the original price for, what, a $25? Still going to get about a 9-2 out of 10. So... Again, you just simply cannot go wrong with this set. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let's get out of here. Grab yourself a sale. Let's go. We'll see you on the next video, guys. Later. Yeah, that ain't gonna happen. Later. Why you